Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Daxon here with Noxide.org here with a uh, video related to WordPress. I see there, there's there lots of articles and videos and things out there of how to use RSS feeds in many different ways, which is basically pulling content from other websites and showing it on your website. Now, um, a lot of those videos are not showing what I believe a lot of people are looking for especially what I was looking for and I know this is supposed to be really simple but for some reason everything no matter how I did it I was missing something and I finally figured it out and what I'm gonna do go ahead and uh, I'll show you You see how I have this it's feed right here it's over here on the side it's a widget um, it's basically pulling the RSS feed from Fox News which is basically right here Fox News now you can you know obviously um, do CNN or you, I mean you can find an RSS feed for whatever you want um, but basically in WordPress all the all WordPress now comes with a widget um, right here it's just called RSS and it says entries from any RSS or Atom feed you basically drag that up into whatever bar or your widget bar you're wanting to do I'll delete this one and I'll go through the whole process with you just to make it as simple as possible. Take this and I'll drag it on up here. Now for in this sample, I'm just gonna do Fox News because that's already you know kind of what I was in the middle of, so I can just uh, name it Fox News. Now to get the actual feed, you can go here. Um, say I'll look for Fox News RSS, okay? And we can see what popped up. Now you can you know find whatever you want if whatever that. Um, new station or website or whatever has an RSS feed you know you're good to go you'll be able to click on it and now here it is here is the actual feed and it gives us a little link here now what I can do is copy this link and I'll go back over to the widget and I will paste it obviously I'll remove this because that front part was just text as you can see where I copied it I don't need the latest headlines I just need the link and then the last thing you need to do is add HTTP in front of it. And once again, you can change your title. You can choose how many you want to display. I think there's other widgets out there to get a little bit fancier, but if you just want something basic, you know, here you go. Um, I'll just have it display. Um, let's do five for now. Okay, and we can click save. that is now saved I can go back to the website and we should have five over here now from the Fox News RSS feed here it is Michigan camera captures 15 inches of snow falling in 13 seconds of course someone visiting you know this is kind of the latest news they can click on it and it's going to take them to that article on Fox News All right, pretty cool and once again I did select for it to show five so we have one two three four five right here in our uh, news feed now we can have you know many different uh, feeds if you want also if you're checking out this video on new social networking website I'm still very much in the beginning stages of creating as well as I have a, a friend investing in it to make it really cool if, you know got over three million people got disabled from Facebook in 2018 alone it's time to do something new. I'm sure it'll never be as big as Facebook. That's not really the goal. The goal is more to have another place besides Facebook that is similar so far as an operation. But anyway, that's enough of that, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully this video helps you. Give it a thumbs up if this video helps you. Subscribe if you like seeing videos about WordPress. I'm always trying to make videos about WordPress and also here on our, our uh, family farm. We do a lot of cool stuff I post videos about, but yeah, that's how you use the RSS feed. Again, thanks for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.